You can change the uh, color of some of the skin elements uh, of the various themes in Pet Diet Designer using a new button we have on the options menu called the color mixer. So just to demonstrate this, let's open up pets and we'll open up this screen here. So we're editing Jade. Um, so go to the options menu and here you can see that you've got blue and your highlighted blue here, highlighting blue there. Select the color mixer and let's just move it around until you find the color that you want. So you can see that some of these elements are changing color. And so when you find a color that you want, just click OK, and there you have a new color from this theme. So let's select another theme. And so the other thing we can do too is just, if you don't like the colors, you can either change it or you just reset it, and it goes back to the original theme color. Press OK. So here we have the original. Let's try Office 2010 Blue. So here when we change it, uh, you'll see that we've got, you can now change um, a few different elements here. So we've got the left and the right. So let's see what happens. We're going to change the left one. So it's like a, a light blue color or actually let's make it red. It looks more like pink. So you have to play around with this. And also you can change the brightness of this hue so to try to get what you want. And then here on the left or the right, we've got an, all the, these are the highlight colors. So you can see here the highlight color. So let's change that to a green. And of course you can, you can adjust the brightness of this. Press OK and there you have it. So you can play around with this to, to figure out whatever colors you want. And this persists. So when you, um, when you close Pet Diet Designer and then reopen it, it will reopen with the, the last color that you uh, selected. And that's it. Thanks for watching.